Okay, so I've had a question this weekend about how to get names to curve on the bottom of a circle. Um, somebody was trying to use my family tile tutorial and they were having a little problem with it. So I thought I'd do a quick little video to show you how I do that. The first thing we're going to do in the Silhouette Studio software is to click on the ellipse or circle icon and hold down the shift key while you draw the circle. That way you'll get a perfect circle every time. Now, if I want to put words or text on the bottom of the circle, I click on my text icon, select whichever font I want to use. For right now, I'm going to go ahead and just use Times New Roman, and I'm going to type Terry, well, got to spell my own name, space, Johnny, Carrie, Kristen. Oops, let's do this. Let's make this longer. So we have more room. Okay, this is myself, my husband, and my girls. Now, that's too large for what I'm doing, so what I'm going to do is select, let's say, first got to go here, I'm going to select 36 point. Now, that's too small for what I want, so let's go in between. That looks about right. But now I want the green box back so I can get this toggle and come in here to um, move the names and wrap them around the circle. So what I'm going to do is I come in from the side and you're going to get them just like that. Now if you want them, if you come in from the side, let me go back and show you. If you come in the side, you got to come down here so that the, the icon here touches the circle on the bottom. Now if you want these to the outside of the circle like your text on the top probably is, you're going to grab this little slider bar and move them out. So if I have text on the top, for example, I did something like um, the Johnson family here. I'll make it a little bit smaller. Go back here, the 30, uh, I think we were at 48. I'm going to come back to get the green box. Okay, now see how this text is on the outside of the circle. You want this text to be on the outside of the circle too. So the key here if it's on the inside of the circle is to grab this slider bar right here and move it out until the top of your lowercase letters are about on the circle. So that looks pretty much lined up. So that's it. It's kind of simple um, and give it a try. Anyway, again, this is Terry from Terry Johnson Creates and let me know if you have any questions.